Okay, it's April 20th and it should be spring and it doesn't feel like it. But down in Connecticut is spring and look what sprung up down there. We've got beautiful Connecticut stone. We call this the old Sturbridge. Uh, we have it in mosaic, thin wall, regular wall stone. You can do anything with it. They all have these beautiful tan and gray colors with a lot of mica schist in them. And it's just a, when the stone's created in the volcanic time, there's a lot of mica. Mica doesn't burn. So it creates levels in the stone that can pull it out of the ground and it doesn't look freshly split. It comes out in layers and you get beautiful gold, silvers, copper colors in it, tans. Goes with any, any home, any color. It's natural earth tones. You look at some of the grains that run through it. Beautiful piece for your wall, very original. And it's naturally thermal. It's a natural slip resistance that occurs. It's, it's granite, it's very grainy, it's coarse, so you're not gonna slip and fall on it if you wanna use it as a piece of flagging, which is great if you have your walls and you wanna do a nice patio or walkway in the flagging. It's sold by the pallets. It's the same stone, same colors, beautiful on a sunny day. And then you wanna do a nice area and you want the same colors or something a little different, beautiful slabs. They come out of the ground just like this. And again, there's a lot of mica in there so they come out in layers and it doesn't look like it's a brand new split. The ice and water has been in there and has weathered the stone over years in the, in the mountainside. So when it's coming out, it looks like it's been sitting on the ground for 20 years. And once in a while, you'll find a piece that's got moss and lichen on it. Not all of them have it, but there's a lot of that do. Some people like that. That'd be a great piece for the front of the walkway to show it off. You wouldn't want to cover it up with another stone. And if it's in a shady area, it will continue to grow. If it's in bright sun, it will probably die off. But this is some of the stone that we have here. And I handpick most of this stuff myself. I'll go down on a Sunday in my truck and find them. Uh, so I can sell them to you. These are actually spoken for from, uh, for a customer that came down to see me, and I hope all is well. I'm uh, Chuck, work here at Landscape Express, New England native stone. Please come down and see me, and hopefully we have something here you like.